Hello Dino Bros, I'm going to quickly talk to you about the aviary and how to unlock it and where to get it. If this video helps you, please like it and don't subscribe to me, but liking helps me outrank those useless Let's Players. Anyways, so I started off the game and I went, I went to Chaos 3, I also did a little bit of the campaign. But I noticed I wasn't getting the aviary pretty quickly, like I just wasn't seeing it. So I figured other people are looking for this. I started the game off, of course, right at Jurassic Park at the original. But I didn't know at the time that that means you're playing it like it's 1993. And there is no cell phones, there is no aviary, there is no water features for that scenario. Because it's 1993. Alright, so... If you want all those updated dinosaur things, you're going to have to click on one of these later ones like Jurassic World or this return one. But I even think that's a different scenario. But also, if you go to sandbox mode and you can play a game in there, uh, you can. I only unlocked two, two areas. But if you click on all buildings, they will all be available, but you'll still have to research them just like regular. I'm going to just jump into a game real quick and show you that. All right, so now that we're in a random game, uh, I'm going to show you that you can research it here in the research. And then now the flying guys are options. And I'm pretty sure it's one of these dinosaur creation. Yeah, so there's your aviary stuff right there that you can unlock um, by increasing your park rating to 2.0, which isn't very hard, actually. And then there's all the other different upgrades. Keep in mind, some of these upgrades do take a lot of um, of scientists or like a lot of uh, uh, perks from the scientists. So make sure when you, you get your scientists, you heavily uh, perk them to one thing. Because there's going to be some things that are re researched that are going to require a lot of like a health perk or a lot of logistics perk. So that's when I when I use my scientists, I kind of focus on what their strengths are instead of trying to make them like overall well-rounded. It doesn't really matter as much if they're well-rounded. Anyways, that's how you unlock the aviary. I hope this helps you. If this video helped you, please like it. So I outrank those useless Let's Players and don't subscribe to me.